I first came across Buddhism on my, I was training to be an acupuncturist and my uh, physio physiology teacher uh, was a Buddhist and just I liked how he was and who he was and uh, we got talking about religion and he was saying he was a Buddhist and he recommended uh, reading the Tibetan Book of Living and Dying and well I did and it really struck me uh, something um, very true uh, and I just liked um, well I liked the principles and what it was saying and it felt like yes I've been trying to do this all my life actually but didn't have a structure or, or knew uh, that it was written down so clearly and that's how I first came across it but actually I've read that book and then I didn't do anything about it um, interesting I thought my life was very good actually uh, I, I looked at my life and uh, I'd got a um, good partner I got a nice home I, you know I was training in, in, in something I was really enjoying uh, I didn't feel I, I was looking I wasn't particularly looking for anything at that moment but a little while later I was on a personal growth workshop um, looking at well, relationships and relating to other people and, and there was a guy on there uh, David Phillips who again I just liked how he was uh, he'd got something about how, how, how he was with with, with people uh, communication and kindness and um, I found out he was a, a Buddhist and just and went to the London Buddhist Centre and I stayed in contact with him I didn't live in London I, he did and um, I wasn't anywhere near a Buddhist centre or anything and we were stayed in contact on the phone and he rang me up and said uh, he said there's a retreat coming up in three days time which I think um, I think would really be up your street. It's a gay men's retreat. It's a week's retreat at, at Padmaloka in, in Norfolk, a men's retreat centre. And I thought, yes, I booked and I went. So three days later, after that call, I found myself at Padmaloka with 54 other gay guys. And um, it was June, it started June 16th, 1995. And uh, I had a fantastic week. I got taught to meditate. Uh, by Maitre Bandhu, who's at the London Buddhist Centre, and uh, the, the, all the teaching was just so inspired. I just felt so inspired and moved and uh, relaxed to a degree like I hadn't been before. And with 54 other like-minded people actually looking at something for something more meaningful in life, particularly. It was interesting being with a group of gay men because so often um, it's in rather superficial world that, that one can mix with them. <laughs> and uh, this is great just being with, with other really, really much more like-minded people than I had been before.